Hello, what is up, noobs? Nathan the Noob here, and I am. This is an episode of Noob News, and I'm going to be talking about China's lifting of a ban on video game consoles. It's over 14 years old. It started in 2000. Um, they're allowing manufacturers to make these consoles, and uh, those manufacturers include the big three. Sony, Nintendo, and Microsoft. So, um, Nintendo's shares just jumped more than 10%. Well, Microsoft jumped 1%. That's still a jump. And Sony didn't really change. So, yeah. But, uh, this 10% is a lot for a day. It's only been out for like two days or something. That's pretty impressive. Imagine, imagine if um, this was longer. The shares would jump more. The economy would get better. Chinese economy would grow. Uh, global economy would grow because there are gaming manufacturers everywhere in the world. Um, and um, this will allow Chinese people to experience what we here in the states and other countries get to experience when we play our favorite consoles. But there is a catch. Sadly, it's true. This is only gonna be manufactured in the Shanghai Free Trade Zone, and I believe it's only able to be used in the Shanghai Free Trade Zone. And um, they might ban it again. They, this is only considered to be temporary. It's been said to the by, by the government of China to be temporary only. Maybe they'll extend it. That'd be great. But as far as we know at the moment, this is just temporary. So what do you guys think? Will this help the gaming industry and the global economy? Will this help the big three in any way? Leave your comments, and I will leave an article from CNN, Money CNN, so you can read it for yourself. Thanks for watching. This has been Nathan Anub, and uh, I hope you have a good day. Bye.